Air Science, Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. Welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support in this reading. For those of you not in communication with your person right now, we are going to find out why are they not reaching out and when will they reach out. And I know that the setting looks different. Uh, it's because I am right now downstairs of the hotel that I'm staying. Uh, in Bali, Indonesia. As you guys know, I'm a digital nomad, so I move around. I got a little bit tired of um, working in my room <laughs> and I just wanted to have some fresh air and I haven't been feeling too well. Let me show you a little bit where I'm at right now. I'm just sitting at this corner where there's nobody. <laughs> but um, let's get a reading started, okay? Just give me one moment, please. Hope you can hear me clearly. It's a little bit noisy. But anyway, spirits and angels, please show me for earth signs, Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. The person not in communication right now, why are they not communicating and when will they communicate? There's some background music too. Oh, they are heartbroken. And a cups, they're doing some things alone, maybe indulging in could be anything alcohol, Netflix, but basically they're alone right now. Then a cups just going through the motion of sadness, going through heartbreak again, three of swords, which indicates your person is sad right now. It could also be socializing with friends, not of sorts, they're stressing out. A lot of things are going on in your head right now, um, earth signs. We've got the Queen of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. So this is you. That means even though they're not communicating with you right now, they're thinking a lot about you, okay? And Three of Swords indicates again that they are very sad, heartbroken, maybe because both of you could be separated or not yeah, obviously, they're not speaking, both of you are not speaking with each other right now, right? Because the King of Pentacles here is in reverse. And also we've got the Chariot here. Your person may not be communicating right now. Perhaps, again, maybe both of you are separated, right? Through your swords. Or there could have been some arguments between the two of you. Someone may have said something here because the King of Pentacles is in love first. And the Chariot also, I feel like your person may not be communicating right now because they think you've already moved on from them. And Nine of Cups, yeah, they think you're happier without them. And this person, your person could be a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, with the King of Wands here in love first. I'm so sorry, I hope you can hear me clearly. <laughs> and now I'm hearing like the music is quite loud. I'm not sure if you guys can hear the music. Um, and Three of Cups is right here. They may also be thinking that you're having fun without them, you're doing great without them, that you don't need them. The Nine of Cups here. The Four of Cups here is in reverse. They feel like you are a missed opportunity. They think you've already made a choice. Like you are very certain with the Chariot here that you're moving on from them, you're doing your own thing. Some of you could be traveling, focusing on your work just also socializing, having a lot of fun, three of cups here without them. And at night, before they go to sleep, they think about you a lot, okay? Hmm. I think eventually they are going to decide to reach out to you, um, but they're still going through this, again, heartbreak, right? Through a, through a sword, very, very sad. I'm gonna pull out a few more cards at the bottom of the deck here. Yeah, five of wands, maybe both, both of you had a fight, arguments, altercation, or could be separated. Eight of cups here, sorry, eight of pentacles here is in one verse. I feel like they could also be very conflicted in regards to whether to reach out to you or not. They're not doing too well, to be honest, uh, earth signs. See, the Nine of Cups here, they could be indulging in certain things. 
either it could be alcohol, it could be cigarettes, it could be anything. Netflix, playing video games. But I feel like this is how how they try to mend their broken heart here with the three of swords. And the tower here is in love first. So they're actually thinking about healing things with you. Undo the damages that may have done to that they may have done to this connection. Something has happened. Again, like Baba wants perhaps you have said something or they have said something. Both of you had a had a fight, an altercation. And they're not taking any actions towards you right now. King of Wands here and first. Because they're just doing them right now. Could be indulging in certain things. I feel like it could be alcohol, three of cups and the nine of cups here if they drink. Else it could be any any other types of indulgement. Uh, four of cups in reverse, two of pentacles in reverse, nine of swords. But once all of that is over, once they, they're done having their fun, either on their own or with their friends, because sometimes I, I can see that sometimes they're, they're just doing their own thing, but also sometimes they hang out with their friends with the three of cups here. Again, they think about you a lot, about what had happened between the two of you. Just give me one moment, please. <coughs> I'm so sorry. This is why I had to get out of my room, because I was just suffocating <laughs> inside. Um, so I needed some fresh air. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pull out a few of the um, oracles here, okay? God, I want to be more than friends. Maybe both of you are separated. Maybe you could have told this person that it's over and then let's just be friends. I want to tell you how I feel. This is something that I feel, yeah, so eventually they're gonna reach out to you and say something. You and I were too young. May not always mean that. It could mean maybe the foundation of a connection is um not not steady or not strong enough or maybe because there's some misunderstanding here with the five of wands so many things remind me of you i wish i could take back my words yeah see so i feel like there could have been some miscommunication between the two of you um or somebody may have said that they are done and they just want to be friends Again, it could be you or this person, but there are definitely regrets here because we've got the Nine of Swords. I don't react when people mention you. I feel like this has more to do with them trying to act cool, trying to look as though they're unfazed by the entire situation. I feel like most likely both of you were in a relationship, right? King and a queen here. Just being near you is intoxicating. So I feel like even though your person is not reaching out to you right now, they still think a lot about you. I still feel that with the Three of Swords here, they are very sad. Mm. This is actually, it feels kind of weird, Nine of Cups. It's like this is what they wanted, but also this is not what they want. I hope that makes sense to you. Hmm. I feel like eventually, again, they are going to reach out to you because they will tell you exactly how they feel, but they're not 100% sure yet whether they should reach out to you, but eventually they are going to, okay? Because they're gonna miss you, they're gonna see you as a missed opportunity, they're gonna think about you way too much to a point that they will eventually reach out to you. Maybe things were being said that was kind of immature or a decision that was being made out of hastiness um, because the King of Wands in reverse also can indicate someone whom didn't quite plan things through. Could be a little bit impulsive as well. So they miss you a lot, even though they're not speaking with you right now. And a lot of regrets, again, things that they have said or decision, again, that they may have made or you may have made. They're trying to keep their cool. I definitely sense them actually trying to move on from you with the chariot here. 
I feel like they think you're really good for them, but at the same time, you could also be bad for them. I hope that makes sense to you. Hmm. Anyway, Earth signs, Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn, this is your reading. I'm so sorry for the background noise. I'm just trying this out because I really didn't want to stay in my room, not feeling too well. But um, anyway, take care. Um, I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. Also, I'll leave you with two playlists on the screen right now. Um, you can check them out if you want to. One playlist is from my second channel. It's a travel vlog channel. Uh, it's titled Asia. The other playlist is it's titled Bonus Completion Reading. Check them out as well. I posted a lot of your readings um, lately. But, they are, but they are, um, some of them are bonuses. Some of them are collective reading. Again, check them out if you want to. And I hope to see you back here soon. Take care. Bye.